listen to this track, bitch. Girl, the way you move it, got me in a trance. DJ turn me up, ladies, this your jam. I'ma sip my scotto, you gon' lose my pants. And I'ma throw this money, why you do it with no hands? Hey guys, WH Tech 92 giving you another weekly video. Um, you can visit my website at whtech.weebly.com or you can just Google WH Tech 92. Um, today I'm going to be showing you guys um, an application called GPS Phone. It'll allow you to play Game Boy Advance ROMs on your iPod Touch or iPhone. Now, first thing you guys want to want to do is open up Cydia. We're going to go to manage sources. You're going to say edit, add, and then I want you guys to type this source repo.insanelyi.com backslash. That is R E P O dot. I N S A N E L Y I dot C O M backslash. I'll have the source in the description if you didn't hear that. And then the second thing we're going to want to download or um, add the source apt dot one two three locker dot com backslash apt dot one two three L O C K E R dot com backslash now the first one will be giving us the gps phone and the second one will be giving us the roms now later i'm gonna have to show you guys how to install the bios to allow this to work now this is for all versions 4.2.1 users may have a little bit of a problem which that's what i'm running right now so i'm just gonna hope that um, everything goes as planned now once you get those sources added we're gonna go to search and then we're gonna say G P S phone okay and then we're gonna go to the second one that says or yeah the second one that says from insanely i repo now only click the one that says from insanely i repo the other ones you either have to buy it or it won't work for your version but some do so i'm just going to be installing this version and you guys are just say install i'm going to say reinstall because i already have it on here and we're going to say confirm now this should take about 30 seconds. Wait for SETI to load. Um, return to Cydia. Now, after you get that installed, which is fairly quick, we're going to go back to manage sources. Now we're going to click on the APT123 locker repository that we installed earlier and go down to whichever package you like and click on it and um, say install. I'm not going to do this because it takes um, about five minutes and I don't know if I can fit that in here. So I already have a package installed. So once you guys get that done, I want you to restart your iPod because for some reason it needs to configure um, when you restart. So 
I'm just going to restart. Now you guys don't have to do this, but I'm doing it because I've had some problems, so. But that's only because I'm running 4.2.1. That's the newest version, so. Okay, and then we're going to turn it back on. Wait for it to boot. Now while we're waiting here, guys, I want to tell you guys a little bit about my website. It's uh, at whtech.weebly.com. It's a pretty sweet site. Um, giving you updates on iOS jailbreaks, weekly videos like this one, and uh, daily deals on technological gadgets that could be useful to you. And it's still booting. Yeah, it's a sweet site. I'll have it in the description, or you can Google it yourself. WH Tech 92. Okay. Okay, unlock it. We're going to open up GPS phone. Now, you're going to click on one of these, and it's not going to work. Now, why, you might ask? Because we don't have the BIOS file. So, I'm going to pause this video, I'm going to get to my computer, and I'm going to show you guys how to SSH into your iPod and install the BIOS file. I will have the BIOS file um, linked in my website, and so just click on my website in the description, um, go to the downloads page and it will be in there okay guys I'm back um now after you've downloaded the um the bios file right here um I want you guys to if you haven't already install open ssh through Cydia on your ipod touch iphone um now if you're running Windows, then I need you to download WinSCP and um, for your computer. And if you're running Mac, um, you need to install Cyberduck. And what we're going to do is after you have OpenSSH installed, we're just going to open up WinSCP. You're going to go to... Uh, you guys are going to say new. Um, I'm just going to say edit since I already have it. And you have to know what your IP address is. This is very helpful if you have SBS settings because then it says it right there. Now if you guys want SBS settings, just install it in Cydia. And mine is the same. Now you want the port number to be 22. Username is root and the password is alpine. That is A L P I N E. Now you're going to say login. And we're logged in. So now what you guys need to do is go back to VAR and go into mobile um and you guys are wanna gonna wanna go to media then ROMs GBA and then what we're gonna do is we're just gonna drag this file see that dragging it right into here now we're gonna say copy and it's going to copy there fairly quick. Now you can just X out of that if you want. And we're going to go back to the iPod Touch or iPhone. Slide to unlock. We're going to go into GPS phone. 
wait for it to load open up one of our ROMs I'm gonna change my theme for this um, now some of these ROMs don't work you can SSH them into the directory I just gave you to install the BIOS and I will give you a site to download those files from just a bit so we're gonna try this one okay so that one doesn't work here let me just SSH one end here just to make sure that it works because then packages sometimes are messed up okay and we're gonna go to let's see here we're just gonna type GBA ROMs uh, let's see here dope ROMs that's the site www.doperoms.com now we're just gonna download Pokemon Emerald you scroll down download ROM I'm gonna pause this video um, once I start SSHing the iPod or the file to the iPod because this will take a while and after you get the zip file downloaded you need to extract it just to have the GBA file and I'll be back to you guys in a little bit okay guys so I got a SSH to my iPod the ROM and this one is it should work now the one I installed had a little bit after it so it's the long one uh, landscape no sound and there we go the iPod Touch second generation MC model 4.2.1 firmware is running GPS phone. Now you guys can play all your Game Boy Advance ROMs on your iPod Touch or iPhone. This is WH Tech 92 and I'm out.